Hello everyone. Thank you so much for being out here today. Um, this is an amazing showing and thank you so much for being out here outside of the Wyatt. Um, my name is Areli. I am an organizer with the Alliance to Mobilize Our Resistance and the Fan Collective. <laughs> now for several months, you know, protesting the riot, um, calling for an end between uh, the collaboration between this detention center and ICE, um, but also in general, calling for this general detention center to be shut down. Yeah. We do not believe in prisons. We do not believe in cages of any sort. We do not believe in camps of any sort. And we demand that they all be freed right now. Yeah. But in general, I want to say thank you so much for being out here and thank you so much for letting me speak today. Um, Amor in general provides a lot of, of legal support for folks that are um, at risk here in Rhode Island. Um, we've been struggling to try to get inside of this facility to provide support for folks, for people that do not know People detained by ICE in this facility are coming in from the so-called U.S.-Mexico border and are seeking asylum and are being brought here because ICE now has an agreement with this, with this detention center. So we're trying to provide... They renewed their agreement um, that they had and are now holding people here that are seeking asylum. And we are trying to get inside and provide them with legal consultation so that they don't think that they have to sign voluntary departure and go back to the violence that they're escaping in the first place. Thank you! Thank you! So, if you're interested in joining our shutdown riot campaign and our movement, please go to amorri.org and contact us and let's and, and plug in in the ways that you can because we're apart from doing this work and organizing to shut this down, we also provide a lot of community-based services for people that need them. Um, for immigration-related things, but for also for police violence things, for mental health, for transportation, for interpretation. We're trying to create a rapid response network of services um, in case people that need the support have, it, have us available to them. So please contact us if you can donate, if you can support in any way. Um, and let's get together to sh make sure that this shit gets shut down. We got to see the We're also going to be passing out flyers. And something else that I wanted you to be aware of is that the Fan Collective has a campaign called Shut Down Ice. And Shut Down Ice is focused on ending agreements between local law enforcement um, such as this and ICE. So all 287G agreements, all IGSAs, we're calling for an end to them because Rhode Island community members do not get detained here, but they get detained in Bristol <laughs> County! <laughs> Shame! Shame! And so huge shame to them and to the sheriffs that sign on to those agreements. Shame. And shame to the Wyatt Detention Center too! It looks like they're bringing people in right now. Okay, so please go to amorri.org and shutdown.org. I'm sending you these, by the way. Thank you. It looks like they're bringing people in right now. Yeah, I know. a march um, starting in Donegan Park uh, near Oneyville and ending in Dexter Park. If you go to the Amor Facebook, follow us there. We're going to be posting and, and, and promoting that event. We're having a march to call for what's been happening down in the border and a lot of the, the pain and loss that's been happening. We want to make a space for people. So please come out to our march on Saturday, June 6th. Sorry, just to clarify, the 
it's a walk, so in Spanish we call it a caminata, and it's very symbolic um, to just kind of thinking about all the folks who have crossed, who are currently crossing, who make it and who don't, right? So a lot of folks don't make it to their journey um, and get stuck in detention centers and cages like we're protesting today, but folks are going to keep coming, right? So our walk is symbolic to say that, you know, no matter what conditions people are, are in, people are going to keep walking, people are going to keep crossing, people are going to keep coming because there's a reason why they're leaving. Nobody wants to leave their home. So if you join us uh, on Saturday or Sunday, rain check, you can check me on more Facebook. It's, it's the least that we can do walking in whatever condition we can, whatever capacity we can, compared to what folks are still doing and will continue to do. And this is our way to show solidarity that no matter what, we will keep walking and we will keep fighting and we will keep resisting for folks. So please join us, follow on more.